Pace e bene, cari fratelli e sorelle. As I said, this, India is facing a lot of struggles created by COVID-19 situation. I ask you to pray for India. As we reflect on St. Francis admonition number 11, Admonition number 11 begins by saying, nothing should displease the servant of God except sin. Nothing should give him trouble. Nothing should cause him anger. Here he speaks of two important values. The first one is a spiritual immunity. And second value is serenity of heart. These two values are very important today and more relevant than any times of history. The world is struggling to find immunity against COVID-19 virus. And the troubles given by the COVID-19 situation took away our peace, our serenity, and we need the real serenity of heart and real immunity to prevent the COVID-19 situation. And India is struggling very much. Many are dying in the hospital. Many are waiting for admission in front of the hospital. Many are at home struggling and waiting to get medical treatment. And in this troubled situation, may God help us to have serenity of heart. May God help us to improve our immunity against this COVID-19 virus. In the admonition 11, Francis speaks of spiritual immunity against evil and also serenity of heart that a servant of God should have. What makes us angry? What gives us trouble? When our eyes are set on achievements, worldly achievements like money, fame and name, and also the love from human beings, the world will give us a lot of struggles, a lot of difficulties. Suppose we are founded well on the love of God, faith in the love of God, trust in the love of God, then we can withstand all evils that come against us. That is the true spiritual immunity. Here I am reminded of Jesus' parable of building the house. One has built his house on sand, another has built his house on the rock. One who has built his house on the rock could not be shaken because he was, his life was founded well. And Francis wants us to found our life on the sure foundation of God. There we will have spiritual immunity. We will be serene at any troubles. So let us have the real faith so that we can go forward with serenity of heart. We will have the real immunity against all evils of the day. Thank you.